Let's find out who is today's freaky expert. Today's freaky expert is heavy metal loving marine biologist, the Blowfish. This man of action loves nothing more than getting up close and personal with nature's most remarkable creatures. He's such a fan of wildlife that he's even named after a fish. But who will he choose as his freak of nature? I love that you walked in and it's blowfish time. It certainly is. It's blowfish yeah. time. Yeah! Blowfish! Yeah. You know we love it. <laughs> right, blowfish, you have got 60 seconds to pitch what you think is the freakiest thing that nature has to offer. At the end of that minute, each of our judges will give you a score out of 10, mm. and the total score will go up oh, no. onto the leaderboard. You're just psyching yourself up there, stroking the beard. Right. What are you going to pitch to us? Well, with the star now as well to be, I've gone for the weirdest head in the animal kingdom. Or should I say, the ocean kingdom? It's the barrel eye! Uh oh! Whoa. Oh! It's business! Get in there! Okay, let's get 60 seconds on the clock because it is time to freak, freak us out! out. Right, okay, uh, the barrel eye. The reason why I picked him is because he's got that weird see through head. Don't believe me? Just check out the footage. Now, this guy, he's got that jelly dome protecting those big green eyes. It's a bit like the cockpit on a fighter jet. And he likes to live deep down in the ocean where it's very dark, so use those sensitive eyes to pick up food before he nails it. But otherwise, <laughs> he spends most of his time chilling out, not doing much, looking freaky, like it, like yeah, it. Yeah. But the reason why he's got that prote protective dome is he's a bit of a thief. Oh. oh, yeah, he likes to steal food from the tentacles of stinging jellyfish. Naughty. So, it's like having your own diver's mask but strap them onto the top of your head. Now, when he goes into the jelly, you see, they can't get the tentacles into the eyes. So he can take his food, do one, and he's absolutely winner. But although he's been known to science for over 70 years, they've only now just been able to prove he's got this weird dome. Because they sent down a big robot camera and filmed him live and intact. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and, oh, 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 but he could have kept going. I don't want wow. you to hurt yourself there. That looks pretty painful. Right, it is time to score, yeah. guys. Right, what do we think? What did, did you think of Blowfish's barrel eye fish? I'd say that was probably one of the best demonstrations I've ever seen. I like the mask thing, thing as well. The mask thing as well. Okay, okay. Andy. Because of the transparent head and the phenomenal um, explanation there, I'm going to give it. An eight. Oh, yeah. An eight. eight out of ten. Come on. Eight, yes. Alexis, oh, eight. Nine. Funny. Nine. 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 No. Oh. And that is a grand no score fish. of 25. Woo. Woo. So that means you knock the Stano's mole off the leaderboard. Get out, And you mole. go straight in at number one. <laughs> there we go, Blowfish. Well, 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 well done, number one. the barrel the eye fish. Now, if you think the barrel eye fish deserves more than 25, then let me know by the diary page of the Blue Peter website. Maybe you know something that is freakier. If you do, tell me what it is. So how long will Blowfish stay at number one? Next time, Mike Dilger's going to be here. He's from The One Show, and he's going to be talking to us about his freak of nature. Freaks of nature. <laughs> OK, from freaks to...